is Wednesday and can't show y'all that area over there. Um, so I am up, I went ahead and got my makeup done. Have not fixed my hair because I'm thinking I'm gonna put a hat on today because I'm just really basically gonna be around the house. I do have clothes on, but I've stuck my robe on. Um, waiting on lady to come to the house to pick up um, an item she's purchased from me from Marketplace. But I thought I would share with y'all the new um, issue. <laughs> You just can't make this stuff up, y'all. Um, so, if you watch my Monday video, you know what kind of Monday I had. Well, thankfully, Tuesday was less exciting. And um, a very chill day. And this morning, which is Wednesday, I don't know if I said that. I think I did, but anyway. Um, I woke up at 5 o'clock this morning and... Um, per usual, get up, go to the bathroom, went to flush the toilet, and it went to flush. So, y'all know we've had issues. Well, if you've been with me for a little while and watched any of my videos, you know we've had issues with our septic thing, pump thing out there that they've had to replace some parts. So, I, get, I go in there and I'm like, James, how do I know if that breaker's stripped? And he's like, have you tried to flush this other toilet? I said, no. So I flush it, it flushes fine. So I get the plunger, try to plunge the front toilet, doesn't work. He goes in there, tries to plunge it, doesn't work. So, had to look for a plumber. <laughs> um, good old Google, went to Google, uh, did a lot of reviews and um, looked at all the reviews and the first guy wouldn't answer the phone, okay. The second one that I called was three weeks out, not gonna work. So the third guy, he's coming today around, he said he'll be here around, he would fit us in this afternoon and around three or four o'clock, so. Yes! <laughs> And um, for all of y'all that thought I handled Monday with such grace and everything, y'all just need to understand that was not me, that was God, because there was a time that that would have just like sent me over the edge and I would have just lost it and been, you know, mad and cussing and fussing and just, you know, but... That was God. So, cannot take credit for that. Making me a cup of coffee because I need it. Um, I don't know what's been going on with me. I have not been able to, like, we go to bed at a decent time and I just can't sleep. So, anyway, strong cup of coffee it is. I'm gonna wait on this lady to get here to pick up her item and then it's probably just gonna be a day here at the house since I've got, I'm gonna wait on this guy. I don't really have anything to do. I think me and my mom might do something tomorrow. I don't know. But yeah, I just thought I would just kinda share that little story with y'all and say happy Wednesday. And I hope y'all are enjoying my video where I've shown y'all all the goodies that I've gotten and um, I can't wait to put them to use and I cannot wait to show y'all the bookcases when they're done. Uh, I don't know how much longer it's gonna be, but it's gonna be worth it. It's gonna be worth it. So hopefully my vacuum cleaner will be here. I accidentally deleted the email where I could track it. I'm so aggravated about that. But um, hopefully it'll be here soon. Oh, I did, um, because I cannot sleep last night. What do you do? You get on your phone and you troll and you, uh, like, shop. <laughs> and so, I did order, um, a couple of wreaths from Amazon for my front door. You know, you really can't tell a lot in the picture. So, I've ordered two. They were very inexpensive, but they looked really pretty in the, in the photos. So, when they get here, which should be... Today, the 
first, 22nd, maybe Thursday or Friday or Friday and Sunday. I don't know. They didn't come together. But anyway, I'll be sure to show y'all that. And uh, hopefully it's supposed to be nice this weekend. Maybe I can start doing a little bit to the front porch. I don't know. We shall see. So I'm going to get my coffee fixed and I will touch base with y'all in a little bit. Okay, I'm going to try something uh, instead of making it look like concrete because I think I have another place for it. I'm going to spray paint it and I've just got some pieces of cans because I'm going to spray paint it a base color, use my candle wax technique, and then I'm going to paint it with another color and then scrape it off and make it chippy looking. That's the plan. We shall see. Wish me luck. First color, I'm going to use this Krylon Fusion Satin Black. Then I'm going to use this dark gray. And I also have this hammered black. So I'm just going to use a little bit of all of them. But first I'm going to start with the Krylon. Pardon me, I'm out of breath. I've just been outside spray painting that chicken that I got. This is kind of what I'm playing with. And I had an idea. I'm going to paint the chicken and distress it. And I think I'm going to set it up there. We will see. But I know I need more greenery. This is all I have right now. And I'm really just putting it up here. Just kind of toy with it and see if I like the way this is looking right now the answer is no but that may change once i get the chicken up there and i may just have to take that copper pail down i don't know i'm just kind of playing with it this is the fun of decorating it's just playing with all your goodies and just you know figuring out what you like so i feel like it needs something right in there and i feel like it needs something up there but i also am thinking about i'm going to have that chicken that it might go up there we'll see so this is where I'm at, <laughs> just playing around. Okay, so this is how the chicken's looking. Doesn't look too bad once you get a, some paint on it. What I did was I kind of went over it with the black, then I went over it with the gray, and then I did I let the overspray of the black fall down on it to kind of give it this color. But what I'm fixing to do is put my candle wax on it, and I'm gonna go over it with this chalk paint. And then I also have the antique wax. And I also have some of this dark wax I might use. And my inspiration is this chicken. So let me get to work on this and I will show y'all as each step as I get it completed so you can see what it looks like. Okay, so the candle wax was not working as easy on this project. So I've heard you can do the same thing with Vaseline. So I went and got this Vaseline. I'm gonna get a paper towel and I'm just gonna kind of rub it over the places that I want it to be distressed, mostly on all the high areas. And go from there. So let me get a paper towel and get it started. So I decided to go ahead and get the ring light out since I was gonna be doing this and just kind of show y'all what I'm doing. So I'll put the candle over here. My craft room's a mess. I'm having to do this in here. So I'm gonna push that out of the way. All right, so got me a paper towel. I'm just gonna get a little bit of Vaseline on it and just kind of go over some of the places. I've never done this before. I don't know what it's gonna be like. I just want some of it to be chippy. <laughs>
am using this little chippy brush. And my paint's kind of, oh, it's bad. So dry it out. It's kind of thick, but I guess that's okay. Our paint is dry I'm going to take I just have this this has come off of one of Buster's little sweaters and it's kind of stiff so I'm just gonna kind of roughly go over and it, it's not giving me any issue especially where we put the, the Vaseline do with that so now I'm going to take my antique wax and I need to get a brush and I'm just gonna brush it on and wipe it off so let me get a brush I've just got this I don't know what kind of brush it is it's just one of the ooh, brushes I had so I'm making sure to get some in the top and I'm just gonna kind of Stipple this on. Okay, so now that it's finished with the antique wax glaze, I thought I had press record and obviously I did not, I'm sorry. But this is it, close up. You do not have to um, do the scraping. Wiping this off does it for you. But now there's still some spots of white and what I wanna do 
is take this dark wax that I have, and I have, I brought this brush, it's just this, I've ruined it from using this wax, so this is just kind of my wax brush. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in some of the places and really get, put this dark wax in there, and I probably won't be able to wipe it out, but that's okay, but I'm gonna be kind of selective with where I put it. For instance, like right here, where I want it to be a little darker. And see how it just added that little bit of dimension right in there. You can't even tell it was broken, really. <laughs> you have to really know what you're looking at and look at it. Okay, so let's see, like right in here. Give me some time, give me some time to get stronger I'll be okay, just give me a little bit longer Yeah, we're gonna win The struggle we're in It's never goodbye, it's never goodbye till it's over Come back to life you think I love it and I'm totally blown away at how it totally camouflaged the broken spots like I mean honestly if you were looking at this would you say oh that's a broken chicken no I don't think so I love it okay I think I'm happy with this. What do y'all think? There's the chicken. You can see glimpses of the copper. Now I probably will get some different greenery and I'm probably gonna get something to go over here on this side. But for now, what do y'all think? Definitely need something on that side so I'm gonna be on the lookout. Oh, I have a great idea what I could get. I'll just have to find it. I actually have, I don't know. I'll have to find it. I have an idea, but this is what that's looking like. So you have to let me know what you think. Love it. Can y'all tell that chicken was broken? <laughs> it's amazing what you can do with some paint and some wax. Well, that felt good to do a little DIYing. I'm trying to get where there's no shadow. Um, it's been a while and I've missed it. I love to do DIYs for stuff that like I'm actually gonna use in my home. And y'all, I'm just blown away by that chicken. I mean, who knew? So I really hope y'all enjoyed that. And now I'm just gonna sit here. I'm gonna wait on the plumber to get here. And he said he would be here between three and four and it's like 3.45 now. So hopefully he will come on. Um, the lady come this morning and bought the piece from me. And I'm gonna have so much more. I've got so much in my attic I wanna go through and put on Marketplace. And um, yeah, get rid of all that and make a little extra money too, you know? It'll help with the little renovation deal we got going on. But um, I'm gonna start editing this video and get hopefully have it up for y'all. I just love spending time with y'all like this. It's so much fun. I hope y'all are enjoying these vlogs. 
Um, I don't know that they'll have to be something every day, but I am definitely trying to um, increase my uploads. You know, every little dime helps, you know, so um, if I can uh, you know, increase my uploads, increase my subscriber count, which I'm not all about numbers, but the more subscribers that watch your videos or more people that watch your videos that might watch an ad or two, you know, it's a little more money, so. And plus, I just love spending time with y'all, quite honestly. I just love spending time with y'all and chatting with y'all in the comments. I haven't got to the comments for today's video, but I'm going to. I like to do that at night um, when James is watching whatever on TV. I like to sit over there and kind of go through the comments and respond back when I'm laying in bed, you know. So, yeah, that's just kind of what I do. But I'm going to start editing this video because I don't know what else is going to happen, if I'm going to add to or, or what, you know. So... I'm going to start editing this video, and we'll see what happens. <laughs> you never know around here. This week has just been crazy. But our weather has been really nice today. I was in and out, and um, it's been really nice. It's not been so hot, but it's been, like, cloudy and sunny, cloudy, sunny, cloudy, sunny. So hopefully this weekend I can get to my front porch and do what I want to do to it. I don't know that I'll buy mums yet. But, um, at least I can get my part of the front porch done. So, and I'm going to live with that in the bedroom for a little while and just kind of see. But for the other side, I think I want to get, y'all know these old, like, I don't even know what they call them. But it's like these garden trellis things that come up into a point, a point you know, it's like, almost like a pyramid shape, but it's metal. And usually they'll have vine wrapped around it. I just want to get something old like that or, you know, something with some height. Um, and that just kind of come to mind. I don't even know if it would look good. And I don't have one, so. But I'll keep my eye out for it. That's part of the thrill of, you know, this decorating stuff. It's just the thrill of the hunt. So, anyway, let me, let me hush. Let me just hush. I just keep on. I, every time I say I'm fixing to start editing this video, I just start another conversation. <sighs> anyway. Now I'm going to start editing this video. <laughs> All right, so Plumber got here and left. And James, I think we're in the wrong business because he made about $95 in about seven minutes. I mean, <laughs> we're in the wrong business, James. I will choose my battles. Battles with a toilet is not one of them I want to ensue. Mm hmm well, I've been busy today, James. I haven't even got to think about what to cook you for dinner. So <laughs> yeah, apparently the plumber looked better than I think. No, I just been so busy. I've been DIYing and decorating. James, I've been DIYing and decorating. You got to get you a job. You spend too much time thinking. I ain't been thinking. I've been DIYing. Yeah, but you've been thinking about DIYing. So, I like it. Well, duh. He's all about his daddy, ain't he? Yeah, so, what do you want for dinner, James? I don't know. I'm gonna look. <laughs> Be sweet, James. Well, if you're that hungry, you should have cooked. I'm not that hungry. Hey, I lost three pounds. I'm proud of myself. Anyway. You cut down to one Milky Way, Milky Way salted caramel a day? No, I hadn't even had one since what? When, since the last one you got me. I've cut way back. Like, I hadn't really been eating a lot. I've just been cutting back. I'm not really dieting, just cutting back. Anyway, we're going to figure out what we're going to do for dinner. I guess I'm going to call this a day. But I hope that y'all have a great day. And I hope I don't have any more issues with this house this week or for the next month or so. Or forever, huh? <laughs> this is life. Adjust. <laughs> Be nice. People think you're a jerk. I'm not a jerk. I'm realistic. Be nice. Somebody that lives a life and has no problems whatsoever. It's not living right. Or maybe they are. Maybe we're getting it wrong. <laughs>
Nobody gets through this life without problems. It's all in how you handle the problems. I I've been doing good though, Hat and I. Hat and I. Yes. I have. I've been doing really well. I haven't let this stress me out. Ordinarily, I would just throw my sucker in the dirt, scream and cuss and fuss and have a little pity party, but I've been taking it in the stride this week. James, you got to admit I've been taking it in the stride this week. James. I don't have to admit. But you know I have. No. Y'all, after she spilled the candle wax Sunday. Monday. Turned, Monday, whatever it was, she turned right around and said, I'm going to bed. <laughs> but I did. Because you had wax to clean up. <laughs> <laughs> but you were sweet and helped me. Uh -huh. With two scrapes. Uh -huh. right. Pick out the perfect tool for you. I know, you did good. Thank there you, babe. You Otherwise, you've been standing over there with a straight razor and scraping for hours. I know. Who saved your time? You did. That's exactly you right. You did. You did. And um, that was a candle that I spilled. I did not know that somebody thought I'd spilled the wax warmer. Was a candle. What did I say? Well, I'm just reiterating was. Oh. <laughs> you look, grammar police. I'm done. Stop. This is me. If you don't like the way I talk. I was just reiterating was. <laughs> He's always getting on to me for my grammar. Anyway. No, that was just, it was a candle. Now it ain't nothing. No, I'm still burning it. I just lost a lot of it on the floor. But anyway, hope y'all have a great evening. We're going to get something to eat, and I will touch base with y'all later. Bye, y'all. You going to say bye? <laughs> you going to say bye? Bye, y'all. Buster, you going to say bye? You going to say bye? Ruh, 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 ruh.